Hey guys, welcome back for another MacBay video. Uh, what I have in front of me is my entry for the fourth round of the ACBA Portal Combat Challenge. Uh, in this challenge, um, participant uh, needs to create a scene based on uh, figures in feature film. So, a uh, scene from a movie and recreate it um, using action figures as you see right here in front of you. Uh, I'm pretty sure you guys have already figured it out what I have. Uh, in terms of my scene and and yeah you know it's basically Forrest Gump uh, and that famous scene where he's sitting on a bench and he has a box of chocolate uh, but uh, for me you know uh, instead of like literally copying and recreating that scene I decided to just put a little twist into it and and so, you know, I have Punisher, you know, with these two Hydra um, agents, so soldiers, that he captured. And, and so he's basically torturing them at this point. And he has this box of chocolate. Oh, sorry. Box of grenades. And basically he's saying life is, life is like a box of grenades. You'll never know when it'll blow up. And the reaction of this Hydra soldier is, you know, basically freaked. He freaked out and, um, you know, trying to stay away from those grenades. And then this uh, Hydra goon behind him is basically, um, I'm thinking in his head, uh, the grenades blowing up. And... Yeah, so that's that's the scene that um, um, I come up with. Um, this uh, dio, it's, it's not really a dio. It's uh, you know, it's I call it accessories because um, it's not really a full diorama. I don't have a background and stuff like that. But uh, I actually um, made a, a quick video. Um, when I was uh, making this so if you're interested in how I you know got this you know together um, then you can look for that uh, video and in terms of behind the scene you know I have this three cutouts and they're uh, being held by simply tacky um, kind of like putty in the back and I have some wires some crap wires um, attached at the back of this uh, cutouts, those three cutouts, to hold them up. Um, so far, so, I mean, so far they're holding there, but sometimes um, over, you know, uh, time, you know, the, the attachment kind of get loose and, you know, uh, actually, yeah, like for example, this one is already kind of going this way, so um before i take my shot i usually fix those make sure they're um kind of like uh you know the bottom edge of that is kind of like parallel to to the, uh, the to the frame um but you guys you know get the idea and that background is basically a picture that i printed uh but since i don't have a oversized uh printer i use three sheets of 11 by 17 um, to print that uh, image and then I just splice those um, together to create that one big um, kind of like panoramic image and that image came from um, online and which is the actual location where that uh, Forrest Gump scene was um, you know happen so you know i mean in this scene i try to or I, at least i try to um, be uh, as close as possible to that scene and that's why you know i end up creating this little diorama accessories um the same thing for that bench so that bench is based on 
you know the um, the design of the original bench that was used in that film and likewise I have a light right here uh, which is basically kind of you know uh, illuminating kinda like this this way and it has an um, it has an umbrella a uh, photography umbrella that I use just to um, um, diffuse the light and I have another light um, right here on my right side which is basically um, illuminating this to make it um, uh, more detailed looking otherwise if you don't have that light it's gonna be kind of it won't be as clear as what you're seeing right now in the video and then of course I have another light behind me on my lap uh, an overhead light that's uh, filling up the rest of the front image you know fill basically filling yeah fill lights so that um, you know you get a clear um, detail of you know the the face the cutouts and you know and the rest of the figures all right well you know that's about it uh i hope that you enjoy um you know looking there it is I made those grenades as well um, since I didn't have uh, a pre-made accessories but um, yeah it came out good too all right well I'm gonna be including uh, still photos um, after this video so that you'll get an idea as to what I was able to come up with all right well thank you guys for joining see you next time